Hey, there's uh, someone here to see Abby. Is this right now, Kathy? Yeah, I have some legal papers to get to her. Have a nice day. These women aren't like they were in the 50s, or the 60s, or even the 70s, when they dropped their children off at the dance studio and they trusted you. I can't have this around kids. Trusted you to do right by them. Today, they question me. They contradict me. What's going on? What happened? I just had an officer of the court walk through my studio and serve me with papers in my business. That's ridiculous. Kelly just wants to get back at Abby any way she can, so she's suing her. And I am worried because we're a fractured team, and this is making it worse. They want you to feel humiliated. This is your studio. This is your property. I this understand that, but I want to make a statement. I don't know about that. It's in your best interest to say nothing. History has proven that Abby's pretty good at digging her own grave. Because if Abby's upset, that means that Abby is always on the defense. And she's angry, she's bitter. And it's inevitable that Abby's going to say something to tick somebody off. I'm scared. Look, we're here. We're supporting you. We're no, part of the I, team. I understand Let's that. get in and have them learn their dances. We have competition this weekend. Otherwise, we let them win. What? can we do with our children to help no, just get help the situation? OK, let's go to class, girls. Come on, girls. That's what we need to do. The group routine is entitled Stomp the Yard, inspired by a hot television show right now. Orange is the New Black. You will be prisoners. Acting in this dance routine is going to prepare you for auditions in Los Angeles. Three weeks until LA. Three weeks, you are going to be studying, training, living, and hopefully working in LA. So moms, we're gonna do headshots tomorrow. You are selling your image. We need to make it fierce. We need to make it rough. Your pardoned criminals. Try to step, let me see that. Can you try to travel forward a little bit? Go. That looks great. What happened before we came here? Abby was served, she was served with the lawsuit today it in her place of business here. in front of all kinds of people. The people who have been here week after week, month after month, we're vulnerable. We're all in a very vulnerable situation. We're totally exposed. And I really resent the fact that you get to go and come as you please, and it's OK. And you still get, you reap the benefits of that. And that's not right. Well, what, but what do you want me to, you want me to go down there and say, oh, this isn't correct, you need to punish me? Everything's fun and games for you guys, and it must be nice. You are disrespecting the team. And so, no, that's exactly. It's a very cowardly way to act. You know what? In some ways, I really do wish that Christy was still here, because at least if Christy was here, she would own all of her actions. I own my actions. No, you don't, because yeah. you're a coward, and all you say, well, don't talk to me about it, talk to Abby but it's your behavior. I'm not the one that made the decision. Oh, but you're the one who acts, or perhaps doesn't act because you're not even showing up when you're supposed to be. You can't even do your job. Hello, how are you? I brought a lot of stuff. This is Becky and her assistant, Nancy. Hi. They're gonna be working with you today. Today, our job is to get the best photos possible that are going to put you out there and say, we want this kid. So I put a timer, we have 15 minutes with each kid. Okay. Do a couple different faces. Really look like you want to kill somebody. Oop, that's your time. Give me something. We have nothing here. Yeah, let's change this. Let's change the jackets. You look a little fake. Whatever happened to the 15 minutes, Abby? We're trying to hurry up. We have nothing here. OK, let's move on. Maddie would be the leading lady be the Jodie Foster. I don't know how we're going to get through everyone. OK. Thank you, Maddie. 
We're good, you're finished, and Kalani's next. what I am hearing. Abby just said that Kalani, Mackenzie, and Maddie are the only ones that are going to book jobs in LA. And I would say something right now, but I don't want to jeopardize Kendall's headshots. Next. Okay, we need a definition though. We, we can't even see her lips. And her under eyes are too dark too. Okay. It's 3.30. We need to be out of this room. Three freaking times, and she still doesn't have lipstick on. Okay, I'm finished. You're on your own, babe. Good luck. <laughs> oh, come on, Abby. That's Nia's turn. Every child got a critique from Abby, except for Nia. Do something sassy and just be you. This has been a roller coaster of emotions this week. And Abby needs to find a target to focus her anger. Abby is showing her true colors, and I don't like what I see. Hey, Abby, listen, I don't so, want, I you don't want. You, you shouldn't be in here, and I'm, don't, I don't care what you want. It's not about what you want. I, I don't know who you are, but you shouldn't be in this dressing room. I brought her in here with me. I know, but why are you in here? You're I in the school in here. suddenly? Right. You didn't ask. I, you didn't say, excuse matter. me, Abby, could I speak to you? Here's you the just, thing. I want, I, I want, I want. I came I want in here to be a good sport. So I'm go, here being go, go, a good go, sport. Go. And I am going to leave. Because I did the you're right thing by coming in here. You're not a good sport, and you're a nervous wreck when you speak. And it's obvious. I'm a nervous wreck? Good luck. Well, if you knew anything about show business, you would not want to say good luck. I can say good luck, break a leg, it doesn't matter. Yes, it does okay, matter. you get asked out, I get asked back. You Go, stalker. And your jacket should be longer than your shirt. I think people are going to continue to try really hard to bring down the ALDC, but I think our girls are strong. I think they're survivors and they're fighters, and they're going to fight on the dance floor. We are starting with entry number 70. Please welcome to the stage, Stomp the Yard. group dance was excellent. If we lose to Jeanette and Ava, watch out. OK, we're going to go ahead and get started here. First, to our Energy Junior small group. We have a lot to prove. People are trying to knock us down. And we have to show that our girls are winners. And we're not going to let it happen. In second place, entry number 69. The challenge. And our top scoring Energy Junior small group is entry number 70, Stomp the Yard. Congratulations. You're creating excuses to protect Maddie's and Kalani's reputations because those kids matter because those are the only ones who are going to work and book jobs anyway. That's bull. I didn't say it. You did. That's bull. You said it. I did not say that. This one. Hey, Maddie. Hey, Maddie. Hey, Maddie. Hey, Maddie. Hey, Maddie. 
You need to be a grown woman and own your words. I, I own my words. That's Abby. ridiculous. It is ridiculous. How many times? It is ridiculous that times? you would want us to be loyal to you, That's wrong. follow you to LA, and you would say that about our children. OK, well, then Nia can stay home. She doesn't need to go to LA. You're not getting rid of me, and you're not getting rid of Nia. We have been here, unlike some people. But I kept Nia on the who, team. Wait, excuse me, but who gets your benefit and your interest? Someone who just walks in no, after being gone true. for several months. I have backed Nia up with those pathetic feet for years. Holly and Jill, they think that their kids are it, and they're not. If the moms can see what I see, then they'll understand what I'm talking about, right? You are a disgrace. Stop it. Stop it. You're an ass. Abby, stop it. Stop it. Ridiculous. I am not your enemy. You know what? You've knocked everyone else off the team. Holly. Knocked everyone else off the team. You're after me now? You're after me? Holly. Who are you going to have on a team? Melissa? I'm not after anyone. You are. Holly, I don't know why you're acting like this. Because I, I told I'm you telling 10 you, years ago. I'm telling you, what you're uh, doing eight is years wrong. years ago that Nia had a great face, that Nia should be doing this, that Nia, I'm the one that told you that. No other dance teacher told you that when she Abby. was little. I told you that. And what I'm hearing now I'm is not the same dance. person who's doing that. You're not advocating for you, her the same way you, you used to. You do what you want to hear. I thought that Nia had pictures, period. I think the woman has lost her mind. Wake up. You need to change your ways. You better do it fast, because pretty soon you're not going to have anyone left. Who's going to stand around and put up with this garbage? We're standing by you, but how much can you put up with?